Um, yeah, I mean, they were nice enough, you know, uh, to bring us into the writers' room before the season started. So we got the opportunity to um, to talk about our characters and how they would react and relate to other characters in the show. So I don't know. It's it's kind of like on a film, you you get to go from here to here and you know where you're going. But on a television show, you kind of don't know what's coming next. So if you can just plant a little seed of something you would like to happen and it's sort of headed in that direction, that's a bonus. Yeah. That makes any sense whatsoever. Yeah. Are there moments, uh, and I guess we could just sort of go down one at a time and just, you know, are there moments this season that were just, that were so overwhelming that you were like, holy crap, I can't, you know, I can't believe we're, we're doing this, like that maybe stuff, whether it may, might make it into the show or not, John, any, anything stick out in your mind? Uh, you know, we, uh, we don't know what, what, what will make it in or what won't. I, I, I think, um, it, uh, it, it's amazing to me that we're allowed to kind of do whatever the heck we want as, as far as uh, bashing and stabbing and, 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 and slitting and, and blood and gore. And, and it's beautiful. I mean, it's, uh, <laughs> I, I look at it now, what he does, it's, it's art. It's not gross at all to me. It's beautiful. But when it comes to the, the sex stuff, you know, there's, 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 uh, Really strict rules, you know what I mean. So I, I that, that that part of it's always that that, that part of it's always been weird for me. So there's things that you know, I think as far as the sex stuff, I don't do not know. have unprotected sex with a zombie. The <laughs> <laughs> one rule. Yeah. Chandler, I, what's up, buddy? This <laughs> <laughs> cute face looking at me from down there, like uh oh. <laughs> what about for you, Lori? What, what, what's uh, anything any particularly stick out? Was that was that kind of your most Remember we'll see this season, or is, is, is there more intense stuff to come for you? No, I'm just getting started. <laughs> Ooh. Literally, I can't give anything away. I know. But, but that's, my, that's my first. <laughs> that's my first zombie kill, that's all I can say. That's my your first? first adventure. Yeah. And, and Lori, too, like, your character, I mean, you guys were basically on a, you were just sister on a road trip when it started. Now, all of a sudden, you know, you have to become a soldier. Basically, so where you know where are you drawing from? Like when you you know when you when you go to work, like what what stuff are you pulling from to for, for Andrew? You know, I mean, I I'm thrilled with my character arc because um, you know it was exhausting being a sad sack that was suicidal all the time. <laughs> um, a very necessary part of the story's telling. Um, but I love the fact that um, that she gets feisty and that she's like, I'm not going to be a victim and I'm not going to feel sorry for myself. And if I'm going to live in this world, I'm going to be strong. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and she looks at the alpha males and says, okay, I'm going to learn this and this and take this and this. And, you know, she's determined to survive and be a leader. So, um, you know, I just, I just feel <coughs> exhilarated. The writing of the scripts is brilliant. I work with incredible people, as Chandler um, said. I mean, he's so sweet. I mean, he makes us better, too. Um, for real. Um, so, you know, I think we all, we're just inspired by each other, by the material, by what we're doing. Um, you know, it's beautiful. It's just, it's, it's, it's gold storytelling. Yeah. Uh, Steve, how, how's the, it's, it's probably going to be a pretty physical, physically challenging season, I would imagine. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's, <laughs> we, we, uh, we, we uh, bleed, you know, sweat and cry for the show, and um, you know it's it's hard work, but it's so awesome. Uh, and it, it's lame to keep reiterating this point, but seriously, like it's it's fun to come to work, uh, not just because of the material, but because you get to work with your friends, and and everyone wants to do such a good job that you know nobody's nobody's sandbagging, nobody's like. Eh. I think I'm gonna sit this take out. You know what I mean? Like it's like ever, ever. You know, it's everyone's on every time, and it's uh, it's it's a joy to work. And you know, there might be times where you're sitting out, uh, and it's open expanse, no cover, 100 percent uh, humidity, 100 degrees, sun beating down on you. Uh, but you know, people are just. We're just doing what we gotta do every day, so it's, it's a blast. Just rotting meat in the hot Atlanta sun. <laughs> oh, it's, it's nasty. And, and you know, I was gonna say earlier about um, the stuff that you know, we don't know if they can get in or not, but uh, it's, it's hilarious because Greg's team does stuff that is so gross that while we're shooting it, 
like I'll be like, uh, people will be like, that's that's never gonna make it in. Like we're just shooting it for fun because it's just gross. Like that's never gonna make it in though. And then inevitably in the cut, it it gets in somehow. So uh, I don't know who is watching me and censoring them, but obviously nobody. Might, yeah, right. Like take the chips out of your hand and watch the show. Like. Or don't. Yeah, or don't. Right. Yeah. It's it's crazy. It's crazy. Well, I think at this point, you know, the bar has been set at a certain place, and if, you know, like, if Andrew went to stab a zombie in the eye, and then it cut away to, like, technical difficulties, please stand by, <laughs> people would be furious. Yeah. I mean, there's a certain, and actually, there's a good question for Greg. Do you feel, do you feel like, you know, how do you constantly raise the bar when, you know, when each episode, there's, there's a handful of, like, holy crap moments? Well, listen, I mean, you know what? I'm still a fan. I mean, you know, I, I love the comic book just like you guys do, and I love the show. If I didn't work on it, I'd be really upset. I'm lucky to be working on it. But I'm, I'm still a fan. So I, I put stuff in there that I, knowing the, the pedigree of the George Romero movies that I've worked on and with Tom Savini and everyone that I... <laughs> And it just so happens everybody else wants to see it too, so it sort of works out. But uh, you know, like the scene with with Lori um, in the uh, in the RV, you know, we have you know we have two multiple units shooting at the same time. We'll have main unit that'll shoot a lot of stuff, and then I'll go in with a second camera and I'll pick up inserts. And, and inevitably, I'm always picking up the stabbing and the blood and the close-ups and the gory bits. And it's pretty much I shoot. Whatever I want, you know. I mean, if I, I want to see somebody get disemboweled or some guy get shit on or something, if I want to shoot that stuff, I'll shoot it, and then they put it in because it's, you know I know the tone of the show and I love that kind of stuff. And you know, it, it just it, you know I, they give me a lot of they let me shoot whatever I want. I get to go shoot zombies, you know, and and, it, and then they get, they put it in. You're an